Hey guys, welcome to my channel and today we're gonna talk about how to create labels in Gmail. So labels are a very nifty feature available in Gmail which can help you organize your thousands of emails into different buckets and so if you need to find an email quickly you can find that email using the labels feature. So for creating a new label you have to log into your Gmail dashboard as I have already logged in here and once you log in this is the default view that uh, you can see in on your gmail dashboard and to create a label go on to the left hand side and click on more and once you click on more a number of different options will appear and you scroll down till you find a create new label option and if you click on this you will get an option of creating a new label so here we have to enter a new label name so what i will do is i will create two new labels one is personal one is professional and then i will create a new label which i will nest in personal or professional so let's create the personal label first so what i do is i write personal and this is a new label called personal and I click on create and as you can see if I will scroll down I can see up a scroll up I can see a personal label over here and if I click on the ellipses beside the personal label I can find that I can change the label color over here I can add a custom color I can remove the custom color in a label list. I can choose different options of showing, show if unread, of hiding the label, then editing the label, removing the label, or adding a sub label. So, as of now, the personal label is created. And what I will do is if I click on it, it will show all the emails with the personal label, but as I have tagged no emails with this personal label, so this is appearing empty. I will again click on the inbox and I will start adding the personal label to my personal email IDs. So I will add the personal label to all my personal email IDs and for adding it, you have to just click on it and drag it to the email that you want to add it to and just drop it there and as you can see i have some linkedin emails and some emails from my email id which i'm marking as personal and all these emails will be personal emails so as you can see i have tagged a couple of emails as personal and here on the email uh, on the personal label i can see that i have and a total of six emails which are tagged as personal and if I click on the personal label all the emails which are which have been tagged as personal will appear here now let's create another label so for creating another label I'll click on more I will go down and then I will click on create new label and this I will for this label I will use a professional tag and I will click on create and then as you scroll up you can see that the professional label has also been created and now I will also put this professional label on some emails that are professional in nature and as you can see these professional emails the number of these professional emails is 5 and what I will do, I will click on the ellipses and I will change the label color. And so you can prioritize according to the color also and see which emails are important and which are not important. Similarly, you can also create a nested label. So for that, I will click on the ellipses and I will add a sub label to this so please enter a new label name so what I will do 
is I will enter a sub label name known as Upwork so under professional this sub label will contain all the emails from Upwork and I will click on create and you can see that under the professional label a sub label has been created known as Upwork so I will tag this email from Upwork with the sub label and as you can see this email has been tagged as professional and Upwork and on the left hand side on the labels you have six emails in personal five in professional and one in Upwork which is a sub label of the professional label I can also change the color of this uh, sub label and I can edit remove or add a sub label to this love sub label also so this is how you create and edit sub sub labels and labels in gmail if you have any difficulties using and creating sub labels you can let me know in the comments and i will try to get back to you as soon as possible if you like the video and want to see regular uh, regular videos on your feed please subscribe to me and hit the bell notification icon so that you can remain updated with the content that I post every week. Signing off, stay safe.